Hi guys, so I kind of was fighting back and forth on if I wanted to film this video and I get a lot of requests from my friends in real life to kind of put a video out showing how to do this but as you know I've recently lost quite a bit of weight and with that I completely lost my breasts um, or a lot of them and I'm kind of feeling a little just different like um, I used to have quite a large chest and it's kind of disappeared and I feel a little lost without without my girls especially oh don't mind my chip nail polish by the way uh, especially when I go out at night with my friends uh, to clubs or something I just feel because it was something that I had and I don't have any more that I just feel a little lost without them definitely if you're somebody who's always had a small chest you probably can't relate um, but if you if you're like me and you had a large chest and then you lost weight and then your chest went away I'm sure you can relate that it's it's tough so I'm gonna show you today in this tutorial how to go from just a regular chest to like a very large and in charge fake looking chest now this is not something that I do every day um, I've grown to like my small chest especially when shopping for clothes but um, when I'm out at night I really enjoy a large chest as you know you just get more looks and it, it gives you a lot of self confidence it does so this video might not be for everybody it might offend some people but for those of you um, who are maybe trans male to female or a drag queen or are somebody who's never had a large chest and always wanted to know what they look like with one or like I have lost my chest and want it back sometimes this video is going to be really really helpful for you okay so my favorite way to do it is like if I'm in a v-neck because I have a lot of space um, and as you can see this is the before so I have a little bit, I'm not wearing any bra at all, I'm just wearing like a little sports, like a sports bra right now, so you can really see that this is my actual boobies. Um, you know, and I want, I want big old boobies. So the first thing you're going to want to do is get a bra. Now the bra that I'm going to be using is actually the bra that I wore before I, um, lost my chest <laughs> basically um, okay so it's the miraculous bra uh, by Victoria's Secret and this bra alone has tons and tons and tons of padding in it it's gonna give you a really large chest anyway because it makes you two sizes bigger but um, this is my current bra size and this is what I was and you can see the difference so um, anyways, uh, this is a miraculous bra and what I would suggest doing if you want to do this, get a bra that's two sizes bigger than your chest now because you're going to need the space to do the work basically. So this bra is about two to two, two to three cup sizes bigger than me now as you can see. So you're going to want to put on the Miraculous Bra. Honestly, it's the best bra for this. Uh, a regular push-up bra is alright, but if you want like big fake looking boobs, go for the Miraculous Bra. Okay, so first step first, put on the bra. Alright, that's on. And as you can see already, hey, ladies are out tonight. So this is just it on. And as you can see, there's quite a big gap inside of it where it's not full. So a quick and easy solution for that is just take your hand and pull up. Make sure there's no nip slips and instant cleavage. Now, the thing about this is getting it to stay up, okay? because you can't be pulling it up all the time all night long or it's going to keep going down. You want it to stay up. So, tube socks. Boop. So these are just ankle socks. They're tiny ankle socks. You're going to want to take it and make sure that they're relatively flat and with the heel portion being the fuller portion, you're going to want to put it down here and underneath your breast because that will push it upwards and you can see the difference from this side to this side in the fullness and then you're going to take your other one pull it up 
All right, now we're talking, now we're talking. Who needs to spend thousands of dollars on surgery, right? Okay, so now here we are. That's pretty much it. Seriously, if I wore this in videos, you guys would start so many rumors that I got a boob job and I don't, oh my God, like this is overwhelming. I feel like Trish Paytas right now. <laughs> All right, okay, okay. See, this is why I should get boob implants because that would just be touching them all the time. So you're gonna wanna make sure that the girls are even. And then if, I mean, you could go like this and that's fine and you're gonna turn enough heads that it really doesn't matter. But if you're like me, you're gonna wanna take it even one step further. So I'm gonna zoom in a little bit. Okay, now we're up and close and personal with the ladies. You're gonna wanna take a bronzer. I personally like the Hula bronzer and you're gonna wanna take a contouring brush. And you're just gonna wanna contour in here. Hi, Emma. My cat is like so confused. And you just lightly, guys. Like, we're not looking to do much except to just add a little bit more definition, you know? Because why not? And then after that, you're going to want to take a highlighter. And my favorite for this is obviously the Mary Luminizer. And you're just going to put that here. Okay, maybe a little on your chest. You know, why not? So now, we've got super big boobies. That for a night out, would get a lot of free drinks, I think. And I'm not saying that you have to do this. I'm saying it makes me more confident when I go out and I look like this. <laughs> so, this is a close up. And I know it looks like fake advertisement. A lot of people get angry about it, but I mean, I'm happily pretty much married and Chris likes my boobs, big or small. So I hope that this could help anybody out that's looking to give themselves a really large, fake and in charge chest. And uh, please be kind and gentle in the comments, guys. Um, no shaming or meanness. This is strictly to help those who need it because uh, these are my little secrets. So I hope that you guys have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Love you. Bye.